hey guys we'll go back to another episode my name is mob we're back with another mod review and uh, look at this we have updated our little home this is now the laboratory of mods so we can test out all of our stuff here now today's mod is going to be called spider mod by afro 1967 now before we get into you know how to craft it and you know how it might run in a regular don't starve game let's go ahead and check out the problems that this thing fixes well you can see I went ahead and uh, summoned a couple spiders and I tried to trap them in a wood wall, you know, for farming, I guess you can say. You, you can probably put the spider den in here, but the results will be the same. Spiders automatically attack wood walls, even though they're not aggroed by any person. As you can see, I had 10 in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Two of them have left somewhere. I don't know where they went. They're gone. They, they already made it out to spider heaven or what have you, or maybe in the stripper bar down the street. But yeah, you can go ahead and put a, you know, replace the spider den in there. Same thing, they're gonna get out. Um, the only good way to farm, you know, spider silk is to either be using those little bulbs or, um, you know, having lots of pigs go up and fight with you. That does take a lot of time and uh, risk on your part, you know. Uh, level two and three spider dens, they summon those jumpy yellow spiders who hurt you. So if you, um, you know, if spider collecting is not your thing, but you still need silk, then uh, there is a, I think, kind of fair way to obtain it. So get ready for this. Um, yeah, the, the thing is called Spider Den. And boom! This is how you, th th this is the overall end product. If we zoom in a little bit here, we can see the spiders in a cage, a little, you know, it's pretty sad, uh, with no flooring, and they have little spider silks here. Now, what you're seeing is three of the spider caged um, silks that have fully grown. Now, let's go ahead and show you the recipe of crafting it. All you need is one spider egg, two gold, four boards, and then all and then over here in structures it will light up. You do not need any other prerequisite science machines, um, like an alchemy engine or so. You can craft it right away, craft it right away, and you can place it down. Now let's do a side by side comparison so I can show you guys the first stage compared to the final stages. There you go. You craft your spider cage, and Wilson says. Hope it's strong enough, because if he gets out while you're sleeping, it's going to murder you or wrap you up and take you back to his home, right? Alright, so as you can see, the the only difference between the, you know, the level 1 to the level 3s and all that stuff is that there is like no webs in the background. Now we're going to go ahead and speed up time a little bit, so you guys can see exactly what level 2 looks like. Um, what was it? It was update speed, update game. Oh, crap! No, forget it. I forgot the uh, command for it. Well, that sucks, but anyway. <laughs> oh, how professional, right? And don't worry, I'll, I'll, I'll freaking memorize all the commands soon. It's going to be helpful. But yeah, um, after a day, one little spider circle pop up. Day two, another spider circle pop up. Okay, so there are, even though there's only three visual, um, three visual stages, there are six overall, and it updates every single day. You can um, harvest one silk all the way up to six. Now, let's go ahead and harvest this one so you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. And this should be six already. Dang, it's five. So it doesn't drop like it usually does when you harvest anything like that. It goes straight to the um, your inventory, which is okay. And then it begins this way. Now, um, let's see. What else do I want? It's okay. So yeah, the um, it's under structure, of course. And uh, you can easily change the mod recipe if you go to the configuration mod button. Hmm. Now. Now that we, you know we showed off the mod and uh, the problem is it solves, would you use this in your um your own mod pack, your own mod world, vanilla plus type of thing? Hmm. I think I would not use it. First of all, the um, you know let me look at the recipe again. The recipe to obtain it: spider cage, two gold and four. Um, two gold and four boards shouldn't be a problem. This one, sure, you have to wait at least a couple days to get it. But as soon as you get it, it is like OP done, and uh, you're just gonna keep getting free silk for the rest of your life. Um, if it was balanced out to maybe, you know, because like the max is six, right? If you can get three per six days, I think that would be just a little bit more fair. And there should be a way that, you know, spiders can maybe get out. Uh, maybe if it starts on fire, not from the inside, but if you accidentally hit it, or maybe hounds attack it, that would be nice. Um, okay, you know what? No, no, wait, wait, wait. Let's test out if you can actually get the spiders back from the thing. So we're going to go to free crafting mode. We're going to grab a little nice little hammer. I want to test out if we can open this up. One, two, three, 
for no <laughs> spiders do not comes out he turns right back into a spider egg so yeah um great mod i like how he you know crafted his own he you know created and designed his nice little spider cage i think it, it, it kind of fits in the style it looks nice but the overall use is nice if you are a casual um like uh, like okay i don't want to say casual player but like y you just want to make things a little bit more easier um but yeah this is a definitely maybe if i ever put this in my game and you know i can consider it fair and all that stuff so yeah that's it for the spider mod spider cage so thank you afro ninja 67 if you guys enjoyed the video leave a like it helps so much if you haven't already hit that subscribe button i upload a lot of daily videos help my channel grow by sharing with your friends posting it anywhere you can on the internet seriously appreciate it more mod reviews on the way let me know guys what do you think of the mod first of all is it a cool mod would you use it is it fair and um, just your overall rating so that's it thanks for being here and i will see you guys next time